Bob the Builder? No. Brooke the Builder? Yes. Why is there so much instructions? Hello? Um, clean up an auto five. All right, so he's got to back to my channel. So today, by the title, we're doing a vlog. Um, I have a whole bunch of stuff to do, so I thought I would bring you guys along. You guys love my vlogs. I don't know why. I feel like my life is so boring, but you guys like to get a little insider peek of what I do on the daily. It's really nothing that special, you guys. I promise you, my life is not interesting. But you guys like to see them, but it is the morning. It is almost 10 o'clock on Thursday, September 9th. Um, I have some cleaning to do. My room is a mess, as always. Um, yeah. It's just, it always gets a mess because I literally film in here, sleep in here, read everything. I edit, I do everything in my room, so it's like one place that, like, gets messy really fast. So, I need to clean it because I have to film today and it's a mess and I cannot deal with this stressfulness in my zone so i'm gonna clean my room um it's a complete mess i have to do some laundry so you guys are gonna basically see me be a um little house mom um yeah i have to do a couple things so we're gonna do that um i don't think we're gonna do anything else today but maybe something else i don't know i have to go get my armpits lasered later today so i might bring you guys along for that but Let's clean my room. I'm gonna go show you guys what we're dealing with. I know it's a mess. I know. Okay. All right. So we're gonna start off here on the bed. It's a mess. I know. Um. Yeah. It's just. It's a lot to deal with. You know. We just. We have a lot going on. But my room in this corner is dirty. My counter is where I get ready. So it's just a mess. I have clothes. These are all clean clothes. I have to pack away. My drawers are just sticking out. Wow. This is really sad. We have dirty clothes here. Um, this is a mix of, like, clean and dirty clothes. Hi, it's me. Um, yeah, my closet's just not doing great, you know? Uh, so, this, I feel like this is, like, a common theme for me, um, for my room to look like this. It's, like, not even shocking at this point. I am a clean freak, but I'm not at the same time. I can't even explain it. I just, I can't. But we're going to clean all this. Oh, that's also clothes that I got sent to me that I need to hang up and go through. Um, yeah, that's a little sneak peek. But let's do this. I have to clean. Also, we have a little paw here. Um, hi. Harley has an extra toe, if no one knows. <laughs> I like to play with it because it's just, he doesn't like it. But um, we have a little Harley here. Um, but I'm so sorry, love. Hello. I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, he's gonna have to get up because I have to strip my bed and clean my comforters. Um, I'm so weird though. I don't sleep in my actual duvet cover unless it's like winter time. I only sleep on top with like two blankets. <laughs> Does anyone else do that? Because I'm like really lazy. I hate making up my bed. So I'm like, oh, if I don't have to sleep in my duvet cover, I won't. So I'll sleep like on top. But I need to clean my um, two comforters that I sleep on. So we're going to do that and clean the rest of my room. So let's get to the laundry and do all that. Okay. I'm not excited for this. Okay, I'm so sorry, love. I'm, I know. Okay. Yeah, no. I'm so sorry. Babes, you're going to have to come up. I know. I'm sorry. Okay. Come on. No. This is why I have a tough time. Hello? I know. He's literally a giant baby. Say hi to the scouts. Say hi. Say hi to the scouts. Did you just burp or did you fart? I don't know. But guys, he is my little sidekick. He's always with me. I love him. But he's got to go today because my room needs to get cleaned. Say hi. He's so over me. He's like, put me down, woman. <laughs> but he looks kind of comfortable. I wish someone would carry me like this. But I'm too heavy. <laughs> Ready? Ready? So I got this new hat and it 
it's a Lakers hat. I have a hat problem. It started with this one, um, and now it's just it's growing. I got this one, and hold on, I have to get it. And this one! Um, this is a New York Yankees hat, and it's brown, and I had to get it because it's brown, and it's a New York Yankees hat, so I just, I had to get it, and it was like, both on sale, so I was like, oh my god, it's such a steal of a deal. Um, yeah. I think I have a problem. But these are my hats now. Uh, while up in the devil by my sorrows, I don't see a bright tomorrow, no. In this body that I borrow, hot bang bangin' like a bongo. Late nights got me feeling high. You the one who make me feel alive. Why I gotta act so tough? I've been feeling so low, I've been feeling so stuck. Oh damn. Life don't give enough. Life don't give enough. Don't give enough. Give enough. Give enough. Give enough. Late nights got me feeling high. You the one who make me feel alive. Why I gotta act so tough? I've been feeling so low, I've been feeling so stuck. Oh damn. Life don't give enough. So guys, I have these command hooks. Um, I put them in my closet because I just need extra like space and storage. So I'm gonna put these up for like my hats and stuff, just cause I don't like them like just hanging around. So I'm gonna actually hang them on like this empty space here, um, and show you guys what it looks like. So that's what we're gonna do. I need a chair though, so. We're gonna put these command hooks on. <laughs> Alright, so I have all the hats there. I love the way it looks. It just, it looks so neat, but like, I don't know. I just like the way it looks. I need to hang up these jackets though on here. Um, it fell because this one broke, but I fixed it. So, that's what I did. This is the closet so far. It looks pretty good. <laughs> okay guys, so it's currently 11.50 now. Um, I just finished like cleaning and everything, so... I'm going to get ready now because I have to film like three videos today so I'm kind of behind schedule I usually like to film by 12 but it's all good so I'm gonna get ready and do my hair and makeup and then we will get to filming and stuff um, I have like an episode video to film uh, book recommendations because you guys have been asking and then I had something else to film. I have to look at my list. I can't remember. But that's what we're doing. So I'm going to get ready. I'm going to curl my hair. I haven't put heat on my hair in almost a month. So I finally like straightened it. But I'm going to curl it. I literally straightened it so I can put it curled. And my hair is naturally curly. It's a different type of curl. Anyways, I'm going to get ready. So let's do it. Okay. finished filming and it is 5 48 right now so um i'm leaving in an hour to go get my laser under my armpits done but i'm gonna make some of my healthy banana muffins so that is what we're doing um so i thought i would show you guys how to make them so yeah let's do that um first you're gonna want to preheat your oven to 375 i'm just gonna use mine here so let's get all the ingredients okay banana muffins. Oh wait, I need pineapple. Alright, so we have all the ingredients here. I'm making banana muffins. That's what I always make, but I use a little bit of pineapple, so make sure you have that. But, let's get into the actual ingredients and I'll show you guys how I make it. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna take my bananas. I pre-freeze mine. Um, I like them super ripe, so I wait till they're brown and then I pop them in the freezer and then when I'm ready, I can just microwave them. So, I use about three, three and a half, depending on the size of the bananas. So, I'm just gonna take these. I'm actually gonna take four bananas this time because they're kind of small. So we're gonna do that. The 
this is like enough. Like I said, about three or four depending on the size. So I'm gonna pop this in the microwave and get it all mushed up. All right, so while that's microwaving, we're not gonna do the dry ingredients. So I'm using actually protein like power cakes. I get this stuff from Costco. This is the box that it comes in. It's just like a protein pancake mix, but I use it as flour and all like my baking stuff. It just makes me like health, like make healthier stuff. Um, and it's protein, so you know, it's better for you. So this kind of fills up like my lack of protein, like when I'm working out and stuff, and it's just healthier overall. So I'm gonna take a cup and one fourth of this um, protein powder, like flour mix, and just put it in a bowl. So we got one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we got one and a fourth cup in here. Put this aside. Why are you laughing? And then we're gonna take baking powder, and I literally just eyeball this. I don't really care. I would say maybe like a teaspoon or half a like yeah, like like a, yeah, like a teaspoon. I don't know. Like I said, I just eyeball it. It turns out fine. So that's all I'm gonna put in the dry ingredients for now. So I'm gonna put this to the side. Oh, see the bananas are ready. All right, so the bananas are all done here, and I'm actually gonna mash these by hand first so I'm just taking like a potato masher whatever and I just mush these down and I don't drain any of like the liquid because if it's runny it's better that means you're just gonna make more so I just oh my god so we're just gonna mash this up together and I like to add pineapple in my banana muffins because I feel like it makes it more moist I know people don't like that word but that's exactly what it is okay sorry um so I'm just gonna take about like a, like half a spear of pineapple and just mash it in. You don't want too much because then the flat the, the flavor is gonna overpower it. So I just put in a little bit there. Okay, these gotta go in together. Break the pineapple up. I'm actually gonna add these small pieces in because they're here. Yum. All right, so now that we got that. We're gonna add the sugar in, and when I do this, I mean actually Splenda. I don't use re sh real sugar, that's why it's like diet. I know people have their opinions about Splenda and how it's bad for you, but um, to each their own, I'm gonna continue to use my Splenda, so leave me alone. Um, so I put in about a cup of this, and I use this. I do a little bit over a cup, so it's like kind of over the rim. And I do that. And I'm actually done with the masher, so we can put that aside. Now I'm gonna take brown sugar Splenda. Again, same type of thing. Um, I don't need as much brown sugar in this, so I'm only gonna take about a tablespoon worth and just pop it in there. I just like the flavor, it's more rich. It tastes better that way. So we're gonna do that. And then we're gonna put in two eggs. Ooh, she one-handed it. I'm a professional, I know. So I'm just gonna pop these in like so and dump these. Okay, so we're just gonna ignore the broken glass on the ground for now. And I'm gonna use a hand mixer, um, like an electric one, and just mix all the wet ingredients together. Um, clean up an auto five. Ow! Plug her in. Um, oh, also I add in all spice in it. It just adds like a little, you know, flavor to it. I just add in maybe like a teaspoon of this. Again, I eyeball it. I'm not like exact measurements. Um, and then I'm putting in banana extract. I know this doesn't really make sense considering baking with bananas, but I feel like it just gives it that like extra oomph, you know what I mean? So I just put in like a couple drops, not a lot. I know it's kind of weird, like I said, but it makes it taste good. So I'm gonna mix this together. All right guys, so now that we have that mixed in together, we are gonna slowly add in the dry ingredients and just put it a little bit at a time. I like to take a spatula to just get around the edges. Just make sure everything's really properly mixed in there. And then we are done. The backup. So I'm just gonna pop this out. 
There we go. And I just like to mix it by hand just to really make sure I get everything off the bottom. So here we have the banana mixture. So I'm gonna put everything away and then we will start putting stuff in the dishes. Is someone bleeding? Oh yeah, it's me. Yes, I'm accident prone. I know. So now that we got that, I'm gonna have my little muffin trays and I always line them with the cupcake liners because these have a tendency to stick so you don't want to use it in the bare metal. Also, we have to do a little trick here. Um, usually these make about 12, maybe sometimes 15. So I'm just gonna line the 12 for now. And then I'm going to take this canola oil spray. Um, you can use actual butter, whatever you want, but I use this because it's like zero calories. So again, sticking with that, you know, low, oops, low diet stuff. So I spray the liners because like I said, these stick. Um, so this just helps them so they don't as much. So I just, it in each one like so there we go got that going on look i'm a baker i don't know how to cook food but i know how to bake so yeah i'm just gonna take a little mini spatula here um and then start scooping it in i'm only gonna use about half the batter so we're just gonna start pouring her in ah Ooh. I'm missing. Uh -huh. Look at those. Oh, I said I wasn't gonna use all of it. I knew that. Okay, good thing I remembered. So we have a little bit left and I'm gonna add a couple blueberries in because I like to make a couple blueberry banana muffins. It just tastes so good, so we're gonna do that. So I have the blueberries here. You can add whatever you want. Chocolate chips. I just like the blueberries. So I'm just gonna mix these in and then we can fill her up. And like I said, this usually makes about 15. So this one's full, so I'm gonna put this aside. And then I'm just gonna line a few here. All clean, got that done. And because this isn't all full, I fill up like the empty ones with water. It just makes it um, bake evenly, all the uh, um, muffins. So I'm just gonna fill these up with water. All right, so now we are gonna pop these in the oven here. All right, and I usually leave those in for about like 10, 12, 13, 14, 15 minutes. <laughs> I honestly just look at them and if I see them, like I stick a fork in them and if they're cooked, then I know they're done. I like them a little bit brown on the top, so it's just personal preference, but between like 12 to 15 minutes, just up to your preference. So we're gonna wait till those are done and we're gonna clean up and I'll show you guys when it's done, okay. All right guys, so because I have a problem, I got two packages in the mail. I thought these were coming tomorrow, but they're here today. So let's open them up together. Okay, let's open here. I love these. Ah! Oh my, I know I have a problem. Okay, it's a book, I know. This one's called Enemies. It's by, I'm not too sure how to pronounce the author's name, but this is what it looks like. It's spelled T-I-J-A-N. But basically this is about a football player and she has loved him since forever. They're neighbors. So I got this book here. I'm very excited. Um, we have another one here. I know it's a book because that's pretty much all I order. <laughs> so we have here it is called um, The Hunter by LJ Shen. I don't even think I meant to get this. I did not mean to get this book. I think I accidentally added this to my cart and I accidentally bought it because I was looking at it, but then I was like, I don't think I want it. This was an accident, but may, it might be good. So I, I guess I'll read it. Um, but these are the two books that I got. Oh my God, look, this is exciting. This vlog is exciting. Um, we got books. So that's what we got. Ta-da! See, I like mine a little bit crispy on the top well not crispy just a little bit golden but this is what they look like we're gonna let them cool down and then we're gonna have one so yeah this is how muffins turn out they taste so good you guys i literally make these like multiple times a week because i love them that much so i'm gonna go shower because i have to leave in 20 minutes to my laser appointment so we're gonna go do that okay we're trying to help the 
sister out, okay? okay I'll zoom in. <laughs> um, you don't need to zoom in real close. <laughs> no, it's not even that. <laughs> laser YYC. Okay, I'll put on the screen here for you guys. If you guys live in Calgary or anywhere near, you guys can go see Mina. She's the best. And you'll get 20% off. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys. Thanks, Mina. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, guys. So, it is Friday, September 10th at 3.55. Um, I just thought I'd do a little pop-in for today. I got another package from Amazon. Um, yeah, I know I have a problem, but this one is a special edition box. It's like the Cinderella movie box. I actually wanted to watch this movie. Um, I heard really bad reviews about it, but I'm still going to watch it. So let's open this package. Let's open her up. I'm always getting packages. I know. I have a problem. Oh, oh okay. Hold on. Wait a minute. Unnecessary, but so. <laughs> Books! Works. We got more books. I really have a problem. I got like six, seven, eight. I got like eight books this week. I know I have a problem. Okay, so the first one we have here is Monster the Monster by LJ Shen. Um, the next book we have here is The Spanish Love Deception. So many people have talked about this, and I was like, I have to get this. Everyone talks about it. They said it's amazing. It's one of like the best books so I'm going to get this um it's actually pretty thick I was not expecting it to be this thick half of most of my books are like half this size so it's a pretty chunky book it's like five almost 500 pages that's a decent size um so I'm excited to read this everyone said it was good so I'm getting on the bandwagon I want to read this next book I got is redeemed this is the fourth book in the dirty air series I have the first three and I was like I need the fourth one to complete my collection um, mostly just to complete my collection, but I also want to read this. I just wanted to show you guys what I got. Um, I just am doing filming today, and I have pictures to go take. So, nothing really special today happening. That's why I didn't really film, but I thought I would show you guys what I got. Um, it just came in, so I was like, ew, exciting. But I'm going to go back after film and take pictures. So, I'll probably see you guys in a couple of days or something, so... So guys, it is Monday, September 13th at 12.28 in the afternoon. Um, I've been up since this morning, like 8.30, but I've been editing, so not very an exciting morning. But I got another package. I know I have a problem. Okay, I order stuff all the time. I buy books all the time. I just have a shopping addiction and not in the right way, but it's fine. This is actually... Okay, I don't know if it's a necessity it, it's a necessity for me. Um, here's the box. So, um, this is the package. It's, um, it's related to books. 
Are you surprised? No, me neither. Um, it's a bookshelf though. Um, so I have to build this because right now my bookshelves are like overflowing. I have books on my desk because I have so many. Um, so I wanted to get this. I'm thinking of putting it on this like wall here. I hope it doesn't get in the way and um like blocked like stuff. My room's not the biggest, but like I said, I'm running out of space. So I kind of needed it to put there. So I thought I would, you know, build this with you guys, bring you guys along, see. Um, <laughs> this is my interesting life. I'm constantly buying stuff, building stuff, putting stuff on my walls, you know, all that fun stuff. So that's what we're doing today. But yesterday, guys, I, I went to the bookstore again. I went to Indigo. I told you guys I have a problem. But yeah, I went to the bookstore and I got some stuff. Um, I didn't get that many. I'm trying to justify buying books, but it's really, it's just not healthy. I have an addiction, I know. Um, my TBR list is about 30 books now, so that's great. Um, I'm just going to show you guys the books that I have that I got. Okay, so the first thing I got is this bookmark. It's just like a little florally bookmark. Uh, I thought it was cute, so I was like, I'll get it. You know, I got three books here. I'm just becoming a book channel at this point. <laughs> I'm, yeah, just, just a book channel. But the first one I got is Love Songs for Skeptics. It's by Christina... Um, I'm not sure how to pronounce her last name, but this is this book here. They're all romances again, guys. Um, and then this one is called Heart and Soul. It's by Jen Frederick. It's this one here. And the last one I got is called The Friend Zone by Amy Jimenez. I don't I, I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm so sorry. But that is all the three books I got. Um, also, I found out on TikTok this morning, I was like looking through it, um, that the author from the books that I got a couple days ago, this author here, I guess she's like super problematic and like she's really racist and stuff, which is actually super disappointing. I hate when like that happens, like when you find out like people are like that. I just don't know why people are like that. I just, it doesn't make sense to me. I don't know. I don't know why people can't just be nice, but I found that out and it was really upsetting and I was like, I don't even want to read these books anymore. Um, but I have them. I don't know. But that was a little update. But we're going to build the bookshelf today. So I'm going to finish editing. And then um, hopefully we get to this today. I don't think I'm going to do anything else. Um, I was going to get ready and take photos today. Because like today is really the only day that I can do that. But I just don't want to get ready. Like I'm lazy. It's a Monday. Like I'm, I'm lazy. I don't know. So we'll see. But... That's so far, that's what's going on. So I thought I'd show you guys. But that was that. <laughs> All right, guys, I finished getting ready. I'm gonna go take pictures. I really didn't wanna get ready, but I did anyways. But this is the outfit. Um, This like sweater button up is from H&M. Um, this is just a bra I have from Walmart. <laughs> and then the jeans are from Fashion Nova. Is this is what it looks like. So I'm gonna go take pictures and then I'm going to come back and I have to film another video and then I'm going to build this and then we will be good to go. Okay, I will see you guys. Hi guys, I'm home now. So my video is on the screen. Just so I was re-watching it to make it sure it's okay for uploading. <laughs> I know it's weird. Um, But I just got home. I took the pictures. I'll put some on here. How they turned out. They turned out good. Thanks to my mom always. She's a great photographer. But we're going to tackle this baby right here. Um, my shelves, I'll show you guys what I'm working with right now. So these are my shelves. Um, obviously, you can see that this stack is like extra big right now. And it's just, you know, it's a lot. Also, I have books here. Like, I just, I have a lot going on. There's just, there's like no space. So I definitely need to make this shelf. And hopefully, my room's also a mess. We're not going to talk about this. My life's a mess. My room's a mess. This will help me stay organized, this bookshelf. That's what I'm thinking. I'm like, bookshelves are for organized people. So the, here's me being organized. No. Um, but yeah, I need to put this together. So that's what we're going to do because this book, situation is not working for me so let's do that okay bob the builder no brooke the builder yes let's do this guys 
See, now if I had a boyfriend, I wouldn't need to do this, but I'm independent, so I don't need a man. Okay, let's open it up and build it. Yay. Mm. So the question is, do I know what the hell I'm doing? No. But are we gonna figure it out? Yes. Mm. I'm already struggling with the package. That's amazing. Um, why is there so much instructions? Hello? I don't know what goes where. <sighs> what the hell, you guys? This is a lot more work than I thought. It's fine. We can do it. It's fine. This is like another level of stress right now. I'm not supposed to be this stressed out over building this. So which side goes where? Devil by my sorrows, I don't see a bright tomorrow. No. In this body that I borrow, hot bang banging like a bongo. <laughs> Late nights got me feeling high. You the one who make me feel alive. Why I gotta act so tough? I've been feeling so low, I've been feeling so stuck. Oh damn. Life don't Feeling high, you the one who make me feel alive. Why I gotta act so tough? I've been feeling so low, I've been feeling so stuck. Oh damn. Life don't give enough. Life don't give enough. Don't give enough. 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 We finished the shelf. I hope it stays on. I think it'll be okay. It's leaning against like the wall, so I think it should be fine. But we're gonna start cleaning up, putting stuff on the shelves, putting my books on here, and make my room look all cute. So let's do that. Okay, so here is the shelf. I'm a little concerned about it. My light switch is right there, so it makes it kind of hard to like press it. But we'll see. If I have to move it, I'll move it. But it's okay for right now. I'm like thinking, I'm like, should I put it there where my mirror is and then move my mirror here or should I leave it? Like, I don't really know. Okay, I'm gonna try switching it and see how it looks and how it fits and if I like it. But then I won't be able to open my closet door. You see, this is a problem. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try it and let's just see. gonna have to work so let's start moving stuff and putting it on the shelf okay all of these and move it Obviously, like I'm gonna need to fill it up. It's just looking really empty. I don't know. If you guys have any suggestions on how I should like lay it out, let me know in the comments. I just I don't know. It's definitely more for like space. Um, my bookshelf is like emptier now, which is what I wanted. But I'm gonna clean the rest of my room and then yeah, I probably should go to the gym tonight. But I just don't want to. <laughs> but I need to. <laughs>
day 646. Um, I'm going to take off my makeup and then go to the gym. I didn't go this morning. I was being lazy. Sorry, I'm going to go tonight. I really don't want to go, but I have to go. I have to push myself, so that is what I'm going to do. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to head over to the gym and all that. Okay. Hey, guys. So, it is Wednesday, September 15th at 5.20. Um, I got some packages, so I thought I would open them on camera with you guys. I have a few. Yeah. Um, I already know this video is just like me opening packages. I know. But I'm going to open it. These handy dandy um, claws come in. Okay. So. Oh, I ordered fairy lights for um, my bookshelf. So I'm going to wrap these around that. So I guess you guys can do that with me. But I just got these off of Amazon. Um, they're like 20 bucks. So I just got these. But we also have this here. I, I got another book. But this one's different, guys. It's not like a romance book or whatever. It's called The 101 Essays That Will Change the Way You Think. It's like kind of like a motivational book. Um, it has like a whole bunch of like little like stuff in it, like essays, quotes, whatever. Um, basically, it's kind of like a self-help book, but not really. I don't even know how to explain it, but I saw some pages on TikTok, and I was like, oh my god, like I want to get this. I just feel like it's really good. It's like nice to like know like you're not alone if you're dealing with something basically that's what this book is um it just has a lot of stuff that like you can relate to or see things from other people's perspective um i like books like that that you can kind of see like an outsider perspective or like get advice from something it kind of just changes like your outlook on life so that's basically what this book is about um it is by brianna weist weist i don't know this is the book though if you guys are wondering um but i got this off of amazon i'm excited i want to do like annotations in it and like write in it um and mark it up so that's basically what i got this for i just want to highlight it kind of you know get more inner you know all that next we have this package here um this is actually from a company that sent it to me i'm so excited it's from merit beauty which is crazy um i just want to thank you guys that's insane to me um i just ugh, i think it's so crazy when companies send things i just it's so weird especially like this company like they're like a sephora brand like they sell their products at sephora which is just, just like ugh, it's so cool to me um so it's kind of like oh my god i couldn't just open the box this time because i'm literally unable to but it's so cool oh guys they're so cute it says less is more and then on the card it says merit minimalistic beauty why am i freaking out and i'm literally like ah! i'm fangirling the essential elevated the only ex accessory you need this is so guys they put it in a little reusable bag. Wait, can I? Oh, I thought it was like a handbag. I was like, can I use this? Um, that is so cute. And they put all the goodies in there. Oh my god, thank you guys so much. This is so nice. I love you guys. Thank you. They're a super like sustainable like company and stuff. Um, they're like a newer brand, but they have like really like clean products and like they're super like minimalistic which i love but thank you guys so much this is so cool um this is amazing but i just wanted to open that up with you guys um i'm gonna put the fairy lights on my bookshelf so we're gonna do that i didn't do much today i've just been editing so today's definitely like a chill day working day um nothing special so yeah i just want to show you guys that that's so cool though so thank you again to merit beauty <laughs> So low, I've been feeling so stuck, oh damn Life don't give enough Life don't give enough Don't give enough 